Quick little video today, we are buying a new carpet. We were looking at those ruggable ones, the ones you can wash that you get advertisements all the time. And uh, we bought a Star Wars one because it doesn't look like Star Wars. It kind of looks like a Native American kind of uh, motif, but it's got some hidden Mandalorian themes in there. Without having seen this carpet, and by the, this is not a sponsored video, I don't know what the carpet looks like. I don't know what the quality, is it woven? Is it printed? Is it soft or hard? or is it a good carpet? I don't know. The carpet arrived today, so we're gonna look at it and uh, you guys can see what a uh, Star Wars carpet looks like and also what the Ruggable carpet looks like if you are interested in that. All right, so here is the rug. This is the box. It came in, so let's just open it up and, and see. Don't cut the rug. So, here we have it. And the way this works is it has the washable upper rug and then there's some mat underneath and there's two types we got the the normal one i think i think there's one that's even squishier but we got the standard one and just looking at the rug it's not woven the pattern isn't woven it's um print is print but it looks fine i mean it's going to look nice on the floor so i don't think it's going to be a problem but let's roll it out and see you can see it's got this uh, Velcro-y kind of material here. All right, put the carpet on. So it's set to, oh, it's just, uh, yeah, Velcro, it just sticks. It's set to align the corners first, nicely. I don't know if you can see, but it's got these little pockets, so I thought maybe supposed to go in the pocket? I'll try that. You know, I'm not gonna do the pockets, that was a uh, pain in the ass. This is a little tedious, but hopefully I don't have to keep doing this. If you have one of these and you know a better way to do this than what I'm doing right now, let me know. This is a little bit of a thing. Aligning it and rolling it straight, if you put down vinyl or anything like that, any material that you have to align and lay down straight, it's, it's, it can be a little tricky. So I'm gonna have to um, keep doing this and make it perfect, but take a look and let me know what you think. Ooh. All right, so this is the carpet. Uh, it's actually pretty nice to uh, touch and sit on and step on. It's soft and uh, it feels pretty good. This one, the standard pad or whatever we ordered, uh, it's a little hard, so maybe consider the squishy one uh, if you are getting it. It's soft to the touch, but it's not a very soft carpet, if you, you don't understand. What I like about this is that it's a very southwestern kind of motif, like Native American. It kind of looks nondescript if you just look at it, but if you look closer, you'll see the little Star Wars clues. This one's called The Child. So this is from the Mandalorian series. And uh, the child is right here in the middle. I mean, if you can tell, it's Grogu's two little ears, eye, eyes, plural, and uh, his little uh, outfit. And these four over here, they are Mandalorian helmets. You see the design? It's, it looks like a, a helmet. Grogu up on here. Grogu down here. All these other ones, I am not sure what they are. They might be big battle cruisers, or it might be related to his armor, his arrows, his weapons. Over here, that looks like a TIE fighter. So I'm pretty sure this is a TIE fighter. The rest is up for interpretation. It also has this Star Wars language, kind of the Star Wars script along the bottom edges. Cannot tell what it says. Hopefully it doesn't say something crazy. So if you speak whatever language this is i don't know what imperial let me know what it says so yeah this is it this is the carpet this is the child so if you're interested in a ruggable carpet or a star wars carpet maybe it's something for your uh, living room like we're doing or for your office or your man cave or your garage or something these are washable and they come in all kinds of different designs not too bad not not a bad purchase i would buy again and it's not sponsored but if ruggable wants to send us some more rugs to swap out and keep in circulation, we would not say no.